Part two with Aisha. Part one, we went down there. She wasn't happy. So we're gonna take a different route because tomorrow she'll be with me, or Wednesday she'll be with me when I come out here with another dog. So I don't want it to be a completely negative experience. So we handle the stressful situations and hopefully you get to see, oh, did you trip? Good girl. So hopefully you got to see in the first video of communication through stress, how we handle this. It's not like she hasn't been to the beach before, but she didn't like the waves being that far, uh, that close to us. Thank you, Aisha. Good girl. Good girl. See, she goes behind me and then waits. Good. She goes behind me and waits. That's a good sign to say, I got you, and you can pet your dog. We're not going. Aisha, stop. <laughs> you cheater. Haha, uh -huh, you stepped on your leash. Stop. Did you go potty? I'm not going to the beach. Come here. Aisha. Thank you. You want to come up? You can come up. Oh, good girl. You want some help? Look at you. So this is what we do. We sit and we relax. Where are you going? I'm not ready to go. You want to get some water though? It's getting a little chilly. Here, get some water. I know you want the truck. We let her know there is a safe spot. You want to go? You want to go walk? Good girl. Let her know there are other options besides having to go to that beach. We can stop and we can walk around. I see it. We're not going. And we can explore around the area that we don't have to actually go there. go much further because we get semi trucks as you can tell there's semi trucks over there so we stay close let her smell let her find out there's stuff going on Aisha let's go back Aisha you ready let's go back we can go to the truck now Thank you. Oh yeah. Good, let's go. You wanna go left? Good girl. Oh, you almost shook it off. Hold on, let's go over here. You wanna go on, the, that's not the ambulance, sorry. We're not going to the beach. We're not going. You wanna go see the birds? I wanna go to the truck. Thank you, Aisha. Here. Oh, you'll do it for a cookie? Yeah, it's funny how that's manipulated. Is that a gopher? There's one in there. Good girl. Did you find it? Get it? Good girl. That hesitation. Wait, what's this one? That redirection. Ooh, what about this one? What's this one? Good girl. Do you remember where you're at? What about. Wait, I see. Right here. Let's go get you. You gonna get it? No? This one? Bell thought there was one there earlier. 
this helps clear her mind. Ready? We'll go find another one. Let's go left. Ooh, I see. Left. Come here. I'll show you. Is there one here? She knows that usually the mounds are usually the real gopher holes. Ooh, what about this one? I see, right there. Is that one? Did you find it? Good girl. And then after you do stressful situations, you find it? Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Is that one there? Did you find it? Where'd it go? Oh yeah? Good girl. Yeah, good girl. Is there more? We find games that she wants to do to help relieve that stress. Good girl. All right, we'll get some water. So when we get back to the car, it's not as stressful. And see, now she doesn't really want to get in. She will. Did you find one? Nothing? All right, you want, you want to go in the front? Or you want to go in the back? You want to go in the back? You do? Go ahead. All right. I don't know why, but that just means we're going to sit and relax. Here, get some water. Good girl. Wait, you chose it. You want to go up front? Come on. Good girl. You're so silly. Are you confused? Go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Good girl. Here. Thank you. And then after stressful situations, we cuddle. Yeah, we cuddle. Thank you. That's part two of communication, showing her that there are other options besides having to go over there. And if you're lucky enough and they want to actually watch you, yeah, straight, yawn it off. They'll watch you go over and do things by yourself. Or if you have another dog, they'll watch you go with another dog. Now close your door. This is Scott with Second and one Canine Life Coaching. Just because you have a stressful situation doesn't mean that has to be the end of it and you have to run and hide. It's about building more options. Okay, watch your tail. I don't know why I said that. I'll be back. I'm going without you. This is Scott with Second No One Canine Live Coaching. Have a great day.